What is up, guys? So right now, uh, I actually just finished filming a video for It's Insanity. You guys should go ahead and check that out because I had microphone problems and yeah, these things happen. It's all good. Um, however, right now, I want to speak uh, on something I just found out about all 2021s. I know this right here is a 2020, but I found out about a lot of the 2021s that are going to be coming out from GM. This is going to be a short video. I just think it's pretty cool. So. In case you guys aren't tech, you know, savvy. Uh, so Android or Google uh, just updated their Google Assistant to have the Google Assistant auto. And it's going to be, you know, they're going through and doing a complete revamp on it. And they're launching it here soon or just launched it. I didn't pay attention a lot to that one, honestly, because it was pretty vague with what they said that everything was going to be doing. However, it seems cool. The part that I care about the most, other than that, because I'm going to buy a Google phone regardless, well, not a Google phone, but a, an Android phone regardless, the part that I care about is the fact that all GM 2021 vehicles, whether you have, I mean, I'm sure it has to have a touchscreen or some form of display along those lines, so not the base models more than likely, but, you know, your upper class, upper class, upper tier uh models like the denali here or a cadillac or uh your normal uh what is what, what what i don't i don't know any of them with a touch screen guys uh any of those are going to have android auto built into it which was the new revamped android auto and they said over time you will got you will you will, wow i can't english right now what's wrong with me Anyways, they said that they will start running entirely on Android. So it will no longer be GM with Android apps implemented into it. They will be running entirely on Android from the display. They're partnering with Google to make this happen. And they're going to have Google Maps embedded into it. So you don't get your, you know, your maps that you have to download the update or, you know, like stick in an update that costs like, uh, 400 bucks i don't honestly know how much it costs i never updated one um so yeah you know you guys don't have to do anything like that anymore it literally comes with google maps and i'm assuming at that point you can do you can download any updates on the map ota and call it a day now do i know this for fact no not at all but this is my speculation and with it being android i'm assuming the interface is going to be rather seamless it's going to be fluid like it would be on your smartphone uh, instead of with a lot of car radio or car car radio car uh, infotainment panels as they like to call it um, they're kind of like jittery sometimes it's more than likely going to steer away from that and going to be seamless and you know when you touch something it flows nicely I don't know because obviously this depends on the processor that goes into it along with the uh, RAM amount and stuff like that because those things do matter whenever you're making a, a display work properly so that's just i mean i i just found that out uh i got an alert from it earlier and i was like i want to make a video on that because i think that's going to be cool it's a really short video because i'm only at three minutes and 30 seconds right now and i still have to chop this up so let me got let me know let me know what you guys think in the comment section below and if you do think it's cool and you think i'm cool or even if you don't think i'm cool and you're just a nice person Leave a like on the or leave a like on the comment. Leave a like on the video as well. Hit the subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that bell so you get notified when I do upload. I know I don't upload on the automotive side a lot, uh, but that's just because I have to buy an SD card for my camera, so I can't do anything. I do have an update coming for you guys here very soon. As soon as I buy an SD card, yeah, that's it. You don't have to be here anymore. Just exit the video. Don't exit the video. Leave a like. Leave a, do the things I said, and then exit the video. Anyway, sorry. Right. Love you guys. Bye.